Hey everybody, it's Ben here from DMC Films, and I'm back with another tutorial. Uh, my previous two works on trees, I've done pine trees and I've done uh, maple trees, and maple and oak trees. And uh, I ha realized I hadn't done anything with a, with a palm tree or a tropical tree. So that's what this is today, and, I, and I'm just about finished with this, but I want to show you basically just how to do uh, the leafing and the branching of this. Basically what I've done so far is I've, I've just used my number one liner brush and uh, made a single... Uh, Single trunk right up, pretty relatively straight, and a little variation as we go. Okay, and, it, and if you're, and I'm just using uh, straight up black acrylic paint. Uh, now, if you want to check out my uh, second tutorial on trees, you'll see just how thin to make that paint, and uh, to get, be able to get the balance where it's solid and not too transparent. Now, for this, basically all we're doing is taking a single line to create a basic form. The droopy curve, like, like so, and that acts as our base. And from there, we just take, uh, just take a little more paint and start flaring up directionally the way the branch is facing, getting those palm leaves. Like so. Now this particular piece, I won't be going in and adding any highlights to this. Uh, this particular series I'm working on is, is just about the silhouette of, uh, of a piece, of uh, or an object, or a tree, or something. And uh, but after after the black silhouette, uh, if you want to go back in and add highlights, you just pick a side, whatever direction light's coming from. Let's say if we had a sun uh, off to the uh, off to the right here, everything on the right would get highlighted, and all the the tips uh, facing the right would get highlighted, and over here you just get a little bit of a highlight on this on this edge and down here. But uh, we're not doing that today. That can be on your own time later on. A fade out edge to that. A little more paint. And, and the one thing to remember with this is just to keep applying your paint. If you start to see the line drag, and uh, it's, so it's not necessarily solid, or if maybe it's too thin, to add a little more of the paint to the water to do that as well. One of the worst things you can do is have it is, is not uh, be real. So like right here, it's starting to get a little. I'm starting to run out of paint here, so I need a little bit more. Down, it's getting thin again. Just keep reapplying the paint to get that effect. A little more coming out the other way. Some variation in there. And that's about it. Now, from here, I've kind of gone in the top again and darkened a little more. Make sure it's solid. And then once on the back side again, make sure this line is smooth. In a few of these branches, you'll notice that there's a couple uh, branches hanging off the up, the underside, and you do want to have that a little bit, but not much. Just a wee little bit here, a little here. And that's about it. Now to finish this piece up, I'm just going to add some grasses down here to the base of the tree. Similar effect, similar uh, way of doing uh, the palm branches. All you're doing is uh, pulling away from there. Some few smaller ones. A little bit of the light variation in there. And that's about it. I'm going to toss in my signature, and that'll be done for this piece. Uh, for more tutorials, check out the DMC Films page, which is YouTube user Davos Moon. That's D-A-V-O-S-M-O-O-N. See you guys next time.